Hey, how's it going everybody? My name is Christopher Buffa and I am here at the flagship Nintendo New York store for the SNES Classic Edition launch. Finally, this micro console is coming out with 21 built-in games, including Star Fox 2. But before we can buy the system, we get to go inside and enjoy this 90s party hosted by Nintendo. So let's go inside and find out if it's all that and a bag of chips. You just got done playing the SNES Classic Edition. What did you think of it? I think the, they did a really good job fixing some of the mistakes with the NES, where the chords are longer, and it, it's it's really cool to see like a mini version of something I grew up with, you know? And just, I, it was really nostalgic for me. It was really cool to sit down and play with it, you know? You, what is your favorite Super Nintendo game of all time? How long did you wait in line for the SNES Classic? 31 hours since Wednesday, 9 a.m. And how did you manage that? Um, willpower, five years of experience, and monk discipline. All right, we're here with Bill and Lance from Contra, from <laughs> Super Contra and the Iconic series. So wait, so your favorite game is obviously Mario Kart. <laughs> yeah, right? I love Contra, it's an awesome game. So, you know, what about Contra 3 stands out to you guys the most? Uh, I love the entire fact that they just upgraded everything from the original Contra. Like the co-op is still there, it still feels like the same old gameplay that we have. It's still the same Nintendo, sit down, play with a buddy next to you or a girl next to you, and kill it and just destroy the levels, man. It's just a fun, fun game. So, and what about you? Like, what do you love about Contra 3? I like it that I can die as many times as I want, and he's always there to help me out, so that's cool. So, so then you've beat Contra 3? Yes, yes, I have. Did you need any cheat code or anything to make it happen? No, I just needed my older brother Caesar by my side, and we just killed it. Sat down there and had my mom screaming at us, telling them to turn off the games, <laughs> and uh, just sat there and played it, loving it. All right, it's all over. The, the standing in line, the sweat, the hunger, was it worth it? Hell yeah, it was worth it. Uh, I mean, 13 hours, I've never waited that long to do anything at all. It's my sister Patricia. We thought we'd, we thought we'd do the wait, you know? We just lost our sister in July, and we were all gonna try to take this trip. Super Nintendo was our life in 1991, 92, whatever. So, I mean, we wanted to relive some of that. You know, that's why we're here. So, you... You guys, you both bought the SNES Classic and the Prima book. You gotta have the Prima book. Uh, yeah, like, what is your history with Super Nintendo? How far does it go back? Well, my first system was the NES. I think I got it the Christmas of 88 or 89. I was young. Uh, that was my first system, but the first system that me and my two sisters shared together was the Super Nintendo. And I got that for my birthday in November of 91. And from there, it was, that was where multiplayer really was born for us. Super Mario Kart, uh, she never wins, but I still play. Battle mode, I mean, that's, that's where it started. It started at the very beginning, and it was always a system, like she said earlier, that we, we return to, and it feels just like it did when we were, you know, eight, nine, 10 years old. So what is your favorite SNES game of all time? I mean, it's really hard. At this moment, I'm most excited about playing Donkey Kong. Just something about it. Just, uh, just, you know, the bananas just jump around. <laughs> also, you know, uh, you can't go wrong with, with Super Mario World, though. I mean, I, I, could, I could play those all day. <laughs> and, oh, 
Mario Kart. Now my brother gives me so much guff about this Mario Kart game. I'm not the one who lost it, but he says I am. And I know I wasn't the one who oh, lost it. Oh, she lost it. He's the last one who had it. And uh, anyway, I'm supposed to always be Yoshi, but he always steals Yoshi from me. So. Are there any games on there aside from Earthbound you haven't played? Ooh, um, well, because I had Nintendo Power, there were games that I was aware of but didn't have or I played at my neighbor's house. I never played Star Fox. I played it on the Nintendo 64. So I got my first taste of Star Fox, which is crazy. Um, I played Super Metroid as a kid, but I played the original one on the Nintendo. But for the most part, you know, I owned maybe 40% of these games, and but 90% of these games I played at my friend's house, you know.